Oh, 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 sorry folks. Welcome back, folks. It's been a long, rough day. It's April the 2nd, or 2nd year, and uh, I'm fixing to go to bed. And I will see y'all in the morning. Probably about, let's, let's go for 6 o'clock. No, let's go for 7. I need an extra hour of sleep. All right, uh, 1,250 vehicle leasing, 483 property maintenance, 148 construction costs. Brings us to 1.2 million, folks. 1.2 million. <sighs> it's, a, it's a beautiful day. Um, a little foggy over here. Woo. Let's go in and check the weather first. Let's see. Yeah, it's May 1st. Uh, where's the weather? Oh, I went the wrong way. Oh, right here. Duh. Okay, so, um, no rain for May 1st. Good. It's May, May the 2nd. May the 2nd, not May 1st. May the 2nd is when it's going to rain. So, anyway, um, check our grass here. Showing three of three ready to harvest, according to the map. All right, that took a while to, to save. Jeez, uh. Uh, oh, I was going to go in here and look at the map, wasn't I? My neighbors are booping. Um, as you can see, the grass areas, the the green, everywhere is ready to mow. That's, that's good. Uh, they got cotton in field one here, and I think it is barley in field two. Oh, crap. I wasn't going to do that. Put barley back on. Field three don't have nothing in it, folks. Nothing at all. We might buy that. But first, but first, um, we also have some trees to pick up. That's what these little red symbols, they're not forest fires now. They're they're logging contracts. So let's, uh, while I'm here close, I want to go check on the sheep, the chickens, or wheat. Now we're only growing six or seven, so we got a little bit more on the wheat. It's looking pretty. It's looking pretty, but we got a lot to do, folks. A lot to do. We got mowing and uh, some construction work. Um, this is what the wood chips looking like. We got two more besides this, so yeah, that, that's coming along pretty nicely. Um, five hundred and one of six hundred and fifty animals in this one. We want to get a bigger sheep pen. Uh oh. Let's turn the super strength phone. We're going to take this pallet here. That's what I got this thing here for. As you can see at the top bar up there, we're about 38%. Might be 40 by the time we're done. Yep, a little over 40. So 8,400 so far in eggs. And, uh, yeah. Let's see where sheep are doing. It's still not very much on the sheep. I got food and water. That's still pretty good. 16 of 300. That, that's, uh, they got plenty of room. Gotta get some mineral feed for down here. Um, yeah, 7,291 out of 50,000. Uh, solarage is getting pretty low and hay. Uh, we might get a tractor. We got some out here still. Um, I guess it's time to go tab tabbing around. What do I got in here? Oh, I got some. Got some hay bales in there. Round bale hay, forty thousand five hundred liters. We need to get that out. Oh yeah. Um, we might do that today. But we're gonna go up here. Uh, in conjunction to our uh, construction up here, we got a John Deere four wheeler, and we got John Deere gators or what do you want to call them, side by side. And what I like about these, uh, I had two different ones in stock, but I I'll probably didn't keep the right one. Huh. 
anyway, they, they're up here setting up lights and stuff because I think tonight, I have to go back and look at my email, but I think tonight is when they're going to drop the antenna. Let's see if this can do it. I guess I kept the wrong one. But this one's got the, uh, I think, auto load feature. That's why I went with it. But anyway, uh, I guess these lights should be shut off, but I'm not going to mess with it. But they got the chain link fence up now. And it goes all the way down around over here. But they told me our next project, uh, they want these logs and stuff picked up down through here. They cut them off the mountain here. Uh, we got some right here that needs to go. And these here. And as you can see, our truck is halfway loaded on that. And the back one has uh, two full things of 200,000 leech. To eat leech? 200,000 liters each of wood chips in them. So, yeah, we gotta put them in the shed. And let's, let's go over here. I, I love this. The, it, they already gave me the remote to this. Watch this. Wow. We got sliding gates up here. But I don't know what we want to have for maintenance. Uh, they, you know, it's going to be our radio tire. And they said the only thing about it is uh, keeping up with maintenance. Uh, it's going to be all gravel. There's not going to be much unless it's a washout. But our Volvo... Um, Dan from 3D Outdoors was running it and he's done a pretty good job he cut down man, that's a brave brother right there he cut down all these trees oh got some stumps left to get all these trees around this mountain here look at all these logs that we gotta get up but they've been building up here I don't know what or why they done that I'm not uh 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 earth person or whatever I just know uh, it looks dangerous but there is a fence around up here um, probably keep people like me from playing on stuff like this but yeah uh, right here it comes kind of in like layers so I guess it won't be such a uh, drop I guess I don't know anyway we do have the side by sides we got this guy here um, Guess I can go ahead and start this. Uh, take these straps off and we're going Z to unload. There we go. That way our truck can come and pick these up. And I don't think they're done with this machine here yet, but when they get done let's move it out of the way because the reason why I say they're not done they gotta come over here and uh, finish this side up um, said something about bringing it on out some more so I hope so um, but I got as uh, being in real life on this game is getting very very laggy for me and uh as you, you can see, if I look over this way, it lags a lot. Go over this way, it runs pretty smoothly. But as far as loading this sucker in from a uh, start menu, or I don't, I don't know, a start menu or what, but let's see, I'm gonna take that, put on auto load to left. Maybe I'll load to your right, maybe. Just have to see. Well, I'll pick up the long ones, not the short one. The short one's going to go on the back. And B. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Um, I got to change that. Yep. Alright, there 
is 12 meters still nothing let's see if hit that again there we go oh wow that one's long that one is very 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 long okay where's my chainsaw oh that froze folks whoo that scared me uh, um hope that yep that's it that excuse me for being a little unrealistic here oh, I can't see for the Sun I'm blinded by the light well, I hope y'all been doing all right I've been doing pretty good uh, been having problems with no internet and uh, I don't even know what day today is I know it's Sunday my daughter went to see her boyfriend my son's in his room playing the game so I figured I'm gonna record so looking at my phone right now today's Sunday the 24th March the 24th at 633 p.m. I guess if you look at the top right corner up there it's got the date and stuff I forgot all about that and a little bitty tiny writing all right, let's pull up a little bit more. I get this stuff off the mountain before the helicopter will even attempt. Oh, that fell out. Uh, I'm not gonna dare switch sides. I'm just gonna throw it up and over. Come on. Yeah. Yeah, give me a second here, folks. There we go. Maybe that worked. Oh, yeah. Strap it down. Turn it off. And I'm going to pull up to this side here. And this may go to our newest lumber mill. Let's see, let's hit, let's hit alt first, and there's uh, two piles, six meter each. I think these are five. So uh, let's go ahead and start for a second. Okay, perfect. That's where I wanted it. I just can't have none load to the back. Okay, probably going to have to get closer. Oh, 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 don't do that in real life. Don't do that in real life. Danny's probably watching like, Tommy, what are you doing? That's a good way to break an axle too. I'm sorry, Dan. Okay, there's just a few more. Oh, I'm gonna stop it right there because you see that? Yeah, that, that'll still work right there. Oh. All right, uh, yeah, I'm glad it didn't do more. So we got that little bit there to get off, but we got a truck down there too. And I wish um, I had somebody to drive this, but uh, Dan, Christy, and all them took the day off. Uh, not really. But we're going to say they took the day off, right? Gamer gone nuts. Uh, there's a bunch of y'all I wish I could call off. I need to get a list or a credit end screen for the ones that surprised uh, watch time oh slow down okay now my son's like why do you I whoa drive like this most of the time well it's easier for me to see and stuff and 
Uh, he said I should start doing side shots and stuff. I'm like, yeah, you know, I should do a lot of things. But he's right, you know, I don't really get the side view of the trucks and stuff. Whoa. Truck got so much horsepower trying to lift up. Y'all see that? Let's see, there's a load on the back with all those wood chips. That one log back there probably ain't helping. Alright, um. Since we got a lot of logs, this one will go here. Let's see, I'm going to go back to the front and take straps off of that. That way I won't hear all that ch 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 sound. That was air brakes, not the electric straps. There we go, we put 46,963 liters in there. I don't know if I got that turned on or not. I'll have to double check that too. Alright, let's pull up to about right there. Switch into the back, take the straps off. And yeah, I gotta get all this stuff up because the lag that's unreal. Alright, did it sell that one? Yes it did. Yes it did. Okay, I'm gonna put a strap. Well, I guess I need that. Yeah, there we go. This is so laggy, it's kind of hard to live with. There we go. All those straps are back. Um, this is where I wish I had another trailer. But I am going to detach that. And pull out. And I guess I'll just park this one right over here. Alright, there we go. Now I gotta run this in to uh, the farm shop to take these wood chips. Actually, I guess we could set the wood chips off here and put them on a flatbed or something over there and then take one of those trucks. Why didn't I do that? Anyway, I'll probably do this off screen. We're going to jump in our other truck. Because we got a dozer pickup too. Okay. Yep, that'll work. Yeah, uh, you hear this and this hydraulics on this trailer here. Uh, let's see, get the very back. I just throw the sign down. Oh, no, don't want to do that. I guess that needs to be this one. There we go. There, now we can go. gonna go out this way and this is just gonna pick up the bulldozer up there but I'm glad we made that much money off of the stones and stuff because that helped us out a lot Jake break turn signal yep turn signal is working We're just taking this up here. Uh, we're going to get Dan or Christy or somebody to load the bulldozer up for us. And um, 
we're going to be picking up these logs and stuff. Probably shouldn't be driving over in this area that got marked. Actually, it feels like concrete. All right, back up just a little. Cause I don't need the. Uh, I guess that should be in Latin too. Um. I don't need the third axle down for the uh, bulldozer. So there, that's set up for them. We uh, take a couple of loads to the sawmill real quick. So I guess let's see. I know I'm gonna do this so alt. We're on the first trailer. I'm hitting the enter button on my key pad on my or the number pad on my keyboard I'm hitting enter and that brings it down to that so I switch over to the back trailer and you see it's, it's uh, about halfway down it says change number of piles it's two at max six meters I want that one pile max 12 meters and then I'm gonna go back to our first trailer and hit B And usually I'll shut it off. I'm gonna strap it and I'm gonna move up instead of doing it while it's loading because that's how you get the funky looking piles as I call them. Oh boy. All right, well, I'm gonna pause it right there for a second. No, not pause it, but pause the loading. Eh, don't jump up on your truck while uh, you're doing this, kids. Matter of fact, don't jump up on your truck, period. There we go. Because you'll fall down. Okay. Hit B again. Now just tap up on the... I'm not too far away. Oh, I didn't touch. Alright, I'm going to back up a little bit. Now what I'm doing here, I'm going to change the speed down to 1, maybe 0, I'm going to get closer first, about like this, cruise, and then hit B. Kind of a slow, drawn out process. Probably need a bulldozer to pull these up a little bit more, but let me. I think I done got rusty that recording. And this happens to me again. If y'all can hear, that's my Xbox controller. I unplugged the USB thing, plug it back up. I don't know if y'all can hear those beep beeps or not. Oh, nice. There it goes. And now I get my stuff back. <sighs> go figure, right? All right, I'm going to go on down here and get some of these up because he's a little bit better about loading. Right, take the straps off. Go ahead and hit the load button. Whoa! Oh, that's going to be just fun. All right, I think that is loaded. I'm going to switch to the back. Hit B. Cruise. And sometimes you got to get back here and just uh, do this number right here. Just grab them just enough to Let go of them, and that works. All right, set my cruise. I'm gonna go ahead and go for one. That should be enough. Keep ahead when they fall. 
And you see the difference when they fall there about, I don't know, about a foot or so away from the thing. Guess it's not going to get the ones all the way over. Let's see if I can get closer. And I got a phone call. I'll be right back. Alright, after a bunch of phone calls later, I done forgot what I was doing. I'm like, oh crap, I still got the game on pause and being uh, recorded and stuff. So, uh, long, long record time there. I got to edit out. But anyway, uh, you see we're 149,414 liters of wood. Wood chips is up to 190,000. Oh, I need to turn that on to uh, to a uh, uh, sale. I'm on. Hit the button. Hit the button. There we go. I brought it up to two hundred thousand. Got to pull up now. Oh, oh man. Let's see if I can unload that B. No, 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 not B. Uh, Z. Okay, good, good, and loaded on the right side there. I'll switch to the back, pull up. Should do it about right there. I'm gonna run myself backwards here. Oh, there's um, one here that fell off. I forgot about it. So yeah, uh, probably maybe one more load after this. Uh, we'll go back over and see, but. All right, that, I got all of it. We're at 250,711 wood, folks. Ooh, doggy. Okay. Right, let's, let's go up and uh, see what we got left real quick, and then we're going to start the mower. We ain't even started the mower yet. But, or can we start the mower? I can't remember. I'm sorry, y'all. I, I, I really am sorry. It's starting to look like it's getting better on the lag since all that's been uh, sold and stuff. Well, ain't sold yet, but it's going to make us some good money. Planks and stuff for the factory and stuff like that. Alright, I might have to... Get right here, B. I'm going to go to O because it might be on the wrong side. There we go. Yeah, I'm going to have to take and push some of these. Basically, all I got to do is kick them, but I'm just going to carry this one. Kind of push. Push. There they go. Yeah. I think that's all of them where it looks. All of them got loaded but this and and put this one over to here. There we go. And let's go ahead and strap and then turn the auto load off. And voila. Yeah, I think I got most of them down through here. Well, Nelly, dead. I really don't want to go off this way. All right. Unstrap so they can roll down. Oh, I'll get it all. One more. There we go. Perfecto. Mundo. Uh, whatever I'm trying to say. I do want to show you one more thing down here before we head on out. Um, this load here might be waited on. To see what the other factory looks like. Yeah, 
Alright, here's our turn. I can probably still make it. I'm going to shoot this off. We're going to walk down here. And this is what Colin Julian was doing. Now he's working on this. I don't know. He's supposed to be skimming it. Just trying to get the sand build up out. Not really, you know, like right here. You can see and over there it's a little bit deeper. There's, uh, you know, this is the sand that came out of there. So, be nice if we had a way to filter this and uh, sell place in. But yeah, um, uh, let me go find my John Deere and I'll be right back. All right, we're here looking at the John Deere and uh, we are at growth stage three of three, ready to harvest. So, let me get this bad boy fired up. Back up a little bit, let her down. Yeah, there we go. I'm trying to hug this fence for a little bit on this first one. And while I'm hugging that fence, I'm gonna do that, that. And about right there, hit again. Then R to resize. And yeah, I, I got grid uh, pairing or grid work or what, whatever it's called. Was uh, supposed to be true north and south, uh, east and west. So I'm not even gonna bother with that little corner. But yeah, GPS uh, for uh, Jordan, my cousin. Those lines right there, yeah, that's GPS. Uh, real life, we don't have that, but yeah, you know, it, it, it's one of those things. So I can lock on like right here, turn screen, go on down, let my things down. There we go. And I can set my, my cruise speed and don't have to worry about doing that. What's that? Uh, what's fast be mowing at that speed? Let's turn that down about 12. Yeah, that's much better speed. Right, I'm on a uh, I would say I put some music in but I think y'all seen this enough in my time of doing farm sim probably see it again here soon so yeah um, I'm just gonna probably make another through there on my right get this worked out here on my left and uh, hire a worker but I gotta make maybe a round and a through on uh, against the fence so it'll be enough well, the fence and a little lag there you're not supposed to shut it off when you're mowing but you know we're going down here a little ways so Let's uh, get turned around here. Turn that back on, lower back down, GPS locked. Do that and who is driving? Oh, me, me's driving, that's, that's why. Print screen, be the thumbnail for y'all. Now, if there's any modders watching this, uh, please, uh, this mower is, what can I say, it, it's flat, it won't flex, uh, either way, I don't think, and I like to, this is the, uh, 
Let's see if I can see it. Oh no. It says John Deere. But it's uh, there's gotta be a logo on somewhere here. Yeah, right there. HX twenty, I believe. But uh well, dry shafts are actually vibrating for I mean, I didn't you notice that. Huh, cool deal. But anyway, uh, what I'm trying to say is I wish somebody would redo this mod. This Batwing, as we call them here in the uh, United States, Arkansas, uh, Batwing moors are known to be for their flexibility when doing ditches and stuff. So that's, I wish... Uh, Yeah, I'm still mowing at 19. That's because I'm using my uh, throttle and not my cruise speed. This uh, probably the last time we're going to use this more. I'm thinking about getting a. Uh, now somebody made me a a, a true flex batwing mower and. Yeah, like this take this and then redo it to where um, it would flex up and down on ditches and hills and stuff. Alright, I'm fixing to turn this off. I'm just using it to get straight. I'm turning GPS off and then hire worker. And who's the worker? I like Christy Nicola, I think. Looks like it. Might be. Hard to tell. But yeah, I'm going to let that do that. And nitrogen is going to be sprayed. pH balance is good, so that's good. Um, I think this is going to be tetted and dried and like all the rest of these over here at Kosher will be uh sullaged. Um we got two sullage thirty one thousand liters of sullage eleven thousand straw fifty two thousand uh hay so yeah we need to make some hay out of that. Um, uh oh, oh, hang on, my phone's ringing. Be right back. I just used, had a guy drop me off, and I've been walking up the hill here. Y'all see what I see? I didn't know they was going to do this, but they said, like, 20 guys up here had a helicopter. And a bunch of cables dangling from this thing. It just looked like something fall, about to fall. And I come up. And look. They just popped the antenna like it was nothing. Well, that's good. That's good. That's, they, they said it would be quick and simple. Okay, now, now all we got to do is run the coax all the way up there and put the antennas on it. Yeah. Uh, yeah, no biggie. Oh, my, running the coax going. Ooh, wee. Okay, well, we, we can do that, but not in this episode. So the antenna tire is up, folks. All right, I'm going to go in here real quick and... All right, um... Yeah, uh, sorry about that. Uh, we're going to go into productions, to generators. And we had this in here. Uh, but, um, even it, let's see. Yeah, that's all the way out right there. But this ain't the one we had. We're doing, and this is 52800 a month. This is one we put down. And yeah, uh huh, uh huh. Uh, 132000 a month. Uh, once we get it going and stuff. Uh, radio tire pack, yep. So yeah, 
produces power which is sold automatically to earn you money but this wouldn't earn us money in real life so what we're going to do we're just saying let me get this off here um get off off I said there we go um this thing right here is going to be our thing that generates us power probably um we're just going to say it is uh you know this amplifies the signal puts the signals out and stuff and uh uh, we'll be digging a trench from one of these power lines over here and that's where we use this and, and yeah so that's what we're going to role play anyway and my mouse and controllers that's not working quite right keeps on want to keep going but I'm thinking about doing on my test map if I can go in here and delete this building don't delete the sale point it'll still be for the containers case in the future we want to do something about it but we can have uh, like solar panels here and that will help with the uh, the antenna tire that we can't see the top of because it's so tall oh wow yeah uh, yeah that's, that's the story behind that so let's uh find our lawnmower a lot more oh no don't tell me it's going to do this okay um sometimes a hired worker on several run force i didn't do my intro right did i i just realized i didn't start my intro right i am slacking um yeah, like this here, he's supposed to turn and went that way, and he didn't. Now, nah, I guess he turned, or well, I don't know which way he went, but anyway, I'm going to take that. Okay, yeah, right there. Hire a worker. Let's see which way the worker is going to turn. And I don't know who that is. We got a new worker. Let's see which way this worker is going to turn. Alright. Okay. Turning good. That, that, that works. Alright. We're going to go uh, apparently a different way. Here we go. This is what I want to do real quick. Um, like as you can see on the bar over here on the right uh everything's down to the ground nothing's good so uh we're gonna do some maintenance on the tractor real quick in other words and i think it's yeah i've done that and i've done that and i got stopped and i'm like well they need to see this because eight months operating hours is almost a little over 19 there and uh it's going to cost 38949 to repair. Oh my. To paint, repaint is 86555 Now do we need to repaint? I'm going to go for it, but y'all put it down below in the comments. Yeah, it's an expensive paint job. Wow. See how long this lasts this time. But anyway, uh, yeah, I can't remember when it was, but... Got a hook up to everything. Was it just a mower that kicked off? Yeah, okay. But I don't know where our additive stuff is. Um, but that's for making sillage. But I think we got plenty enough for this time around. And I don't know what I've done with it, so yeah. But anyway, uh, tenders not going to go on this tractor. Just going to keep the mower set up. Uh, not the mower set up. 
I totally forgot about the big uh, big moor we got. We're using the bat wing over there, and yeah, um, I'm gonna cut through here. Oh, the gate's open anyway. Ah, let me stop right here. I'm gonna turn this off. Um, yeah, see, we we bought this, and uh, yeah. Oops. Do I have a tether? That's a wind roller. There should be a tether somewhere. Hey, chick chicks. Oh, there's a tether. Okay, I knew I had one somewhere. Ah, I get trapped in the sprayer. I want to buy a different sprayer too, but of course, you know, we got to save money for the tower and stuff. Um, Cause we still ain't done with construction cause we gotta dig, haul that rock off and hopefully make money from that rock instead of losing money. And we do need some more rock for the sides and stuff too. So, oh, oh, crashed in the pole, crap. Oh, there's a train in real life. Guess I need to pay attention to the road here. But we may just end up, even this here might be hay. Also, not really for sure. But you know what? This is May. And I don't want to go with that. And while that's unfold, I'm going to go here. Alright, here we are. Field 3. Which is lot 26, I guess. We'll get all this up for this diner that's here and this house that's right here. Um, so, yeah, we'll probably can take these trees out and stuff, make this bigger, and make a, a farmland out of this. And I don't know how hilly this is. Actually, I don't know how hilly none of it is. So, um, let's go. Sorry about that, folks. I'm trying to, uh, won't let me visit that place. I'll visit this place. It's the Waffle Hut. Breakfast, dinner, lunch, 24 hours. Oh my, look here. Joy of Bellin. Hmm, cool. But anyway, it starts down there at the, uh, bridge down here. Here's our, no, there's not a, turn road there oh the turn roads right here duh we might leave this for these people that go to their house but we might move it um like we might take it through i don't want to run through all these bushes but closer to the water here <coughs> and around and about and, and yeah, just come down through here like this and make them a road. I gotta come in here and talk to them. Don't look like nobody's home. Do they even use a vehicle? They might use a boat. I don't, I have no idea, folks. But in all secrecy, uh, let me get back over here and kind of go through here. I want to show y'all something. Oh, yep. Oh, busted my nose. Oh, what's this? It's a blue X. It's a blue X on that tree. Man, I'm stuck. Let's get down here where we can see a little bit better. Blue X here, Blue X, 
blue X. Yeah, see where I'm going with the blue X is now? Blue X. Yeah, I didn't mark that. And, oh, right here. Oh, why I didn't? Oh, because I can't cut that. This is the end of the map right here. Far as I can go. So, the one with the blue X is where we're going to clear. It's kind of like straight through here. And I think it's... Oh, yeah, right here. That boundary line is kind of an angle down through there. So, yeah, like this. And, and then it'll be that. And, but that won't be that because it's too close. So, where there's blue X's, where we be removing the trees. And you can see me on the map at the bottom left corner. All these trees are going to come out. Yes, yes, I know. It's a forest map, y'all. Don't get me about the trees. We are going to replant trees. I, I promise you, we're going to replant trees. We just got to get a lot of things going first. But anyway, um, make sure I showed y'all everything. They dropped the tire. We're going to have to get these lights off and put them up. And figure out what we're going to keep because we may be putting another tower up on a different mountain way over yonder, maybe somewhere. I think it was kind of fun, kind of helped boost the game some, you know. But I do want to do some farming on here, and, and just besides this, uh, you know, other stuff. But the Volvo, it's been uh, very helpful. Uh, we're going to get some more of these trees right there and some around on that side. And I'm wasting fuel. There we go. And same with this. Get my... Oh, I'm getting too close to the... Close to the fence, I'm trying to bend things. That's why I should have a little uh, road around it. That way we know where our boundary is. Alright, now do that. We're going to do that. And we know our line. But Jabella will pick most of that up. We don't have to worry about it too much, but or the wind roller and get up tighter. But yeah, um, that's about all I had to show y'all. We're just uh, basically gonna come in here and do some hay work. I'm gonna uh, finish getting this mode off screen get some other things done uh, when we'll come back we'll be wind rolling and bailing this field and I gotta check I, I think I'm on everything that's like on this side of the wheat field will be hay and everything we do further out will be sillage Start GPS and they ain't using it, ain't that something? There we go. I'll lock on. Give my finger trigger some uh, stuff there. Oh, now that's a good one. I'll be done before he even gets caught up. Good. Look like it's leaving some spots around. There's a spot in front of the tractor right there. Alright. Yeah, some spots there. Probably was going too fast or something. Which I'll knock this down about 14. 
because we'll catch up real quick with them but uh yeah i believe that's everything i had to show y'all and it's almost an hour in 57 minutes and uh i don't want to make these too long because uh ed um, is terrible sometimes with me i'll fall asleep it'll still be playing and i gotta find out where i fell asleep at and uh, yeah it's one of those things folks Anyway, uh, I appreciate y'all coming out and watching, and uh, thank all to all the new subscribers and stuff. Thank y'all for helping out. Um, time of making this, I got one subscriber, and I'll be 325 subscribers to go to a thousand. So, uh, try get 300 of your friends subscribed to me, folks. <laughs> Oh, yeah, it'd be so helpful. But anyway, um, I do have, a, I think, a Cash App uh, thing on, on my description below. Uh, if, you, if you can, it, it'd be awesome. But if you can't, whoa. If you can't, I understand. Your watch time is plenty enough. And uh, help get me to a uh, thousand members. Then I can be making my own money off of YouTube. But it's not all about the money, yo. I would probably still be doing this if it was uh, no money involved. Because uh, I'm doing two things. I'm talking to my community that I love very much. And I am playing a game that I love very, 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 very much, as y'all can tell. I play it 24-7 just about when I can. I'm going to stop this, let him get caught up. And folks, y'all have a great day, a blessed day, and I will see you in the next episode. You're then farming with Mr. Blue, a.k.a. Tommy Miller. All right, sir, you're fired. I'm sorry. You don't have to go all the way out to the end and back up. No, no. It's, that's probably the best way to go, but anyway, folks, y'all, I'll see y'all later. Bye.